Okay, could you first start by telling us your name? Yes, my name is Kelvin L. Martin. Um, what does a successful commemoration of July 1967 look like to you? A successful commemoration to me would basically to pay tribute to the events that happened on that particular uh, month in 1967. And we need to address it so that these same events won't happen again. And that's what it means to me. Okay. And what would you call the uh, events of July 1967? Well, the events that happened in 1967, to me, of course, because I wasn't born, was basically like people's cup runneth over and they were just fed up with what was going on. So they did a lot of rioting to uh, retaliate, basically, which I understand. However, I don't think that rioting, to me in particular, is the best way to go. However... That's the way that they vented, and I mean, that's what happened. So, of course, I wasn't born. I mean, I have read up on it, did some research. However, that's what happened to me. So, um, And how do you see Detroit today? Detroit today is beautiful. In one word, uh, redeveloping. Uh, it's just a new, fun atmosphere. It's the town that people travel to now to, to my knowledge i see it i meet a lot of people they say oh i'm here from california i'm here from new york and i'm like wow that's awesome because you can go to say to the river rock and feel like you're on vacation and that's awesome so i feel like detroit is the place to be okay and where do you see the city going in the future uh continuous improvement i feel like it's just going to constantly rebuild I feel that with the youth and with all the energy that's going on, it's going to also redevelop their minds and they're going to see how beautiful Detroit is and they're going to pay respect to it. And it's just going to be the, the city to go to. Uh, it's not going to be just New York and L.A. It's going to be Detroit. And my vision is people across the world have their Detroit hat on it, on it here at representing. So. Very nice. Thank you very much. You're very welcome. Thank you very much.